Hey everybody, welcome back to Enliven Wellness. I'm super excited to be here on another Saturday with you um, in my super clean, yay, home. Um, first, I wanted to say thank you so much to the people who are subscribing. I hope that my videos are helping you in some way. Um, I'm sad if you're going through some of the same stuff that I've been going through. I know a lot of you have reached out saying like, I just got to the hospital for this and like, oh my God, I feel like I'm going crazy and believe me, like I've been there with you, so I get it. Um, but today I wanted to make a quick video on how to test your home for mold. Like you, you might be experiencing the symptoms, you probably have some questions about like how do I go about testing about like this and what are some resources. So that's what I'm going to talk about today. Um, but before I go into that, again, I'd like to say, you know, comment, subscribe, share um, to this channel. Again, I just am trying to bring my experience to help those of you out there who might be going through, unfortunately, the same thing that I went through, the same hell that I went through. So. Um, anyway, all right, so let's get started. So how did I finally get confirmation that I had stachybotrys? And again, stachybotrys is like one of the toxicest, if that's a word, um, black molds out there. And uh, I had it in my kitchen. I also had it in my garage. Um, so I first started to do some research and I looked up various tests um, to test myself for mold exposure and those ended up not being the route that I went. Um, I first wanted to make sure that my home did have mold so that I could compare it and also for legal reasons I wanted to have that evidence. Um, so the very first thing that I did was I googled mold remediation services and thankfully I found an amazing amazing gentleman here in Colorado and if you want his contact information and you're in Colorado let me know and I'll get you hooked up with him. He really has been like my right hand man. Um, but he, his wife also has dealt with a lot of chronic health issues, so his heart is actually in this business. Um, in your own individual home, town, or wherever you're living, um, just Google mold remediation services. However, I would call several of them and ask them what kind of testing they do for the mold. Like, how do they find it? Um, so this is just a, this is, there's going to be a more specialized test that I'm going to bring up in just a minute, but the initial test that I did was called an air sample test. And basically what this guy did when he came into my house was he set up different areas around my house with this little device and he sucked air out of the air and he tested it for the mold species. Um, and we also compare, you also compare it to the outside mold species just to see like what the index is in your home. So we did that in several different rooms as compared to the outdoors. And then he was able to get me the test results within a day. So that was amazing. And then he came back and said, you have stacky. Um, so that was my first test. So first test, number one I did was a, an air sample test. Now, when I started going to school for this, um, my program director, who again is an expert in environmental medicine, Dr. Andrew Heyman, Amazing, amazing man. Um, I very much love his work and I love that I'm in his program. He turned me on to something called the ERMI test. E-R-M-I. And this is a test that you can order online and I'll provide a link down below where you can order it. And basically what the ERMI test is, is it actually tests for the DNA of mold in the location that you're in. And so it's really sweet, you order the kit and you'll wanna get this swab kit and they send you basically like a Swiffer pad and you'll go around your house, your location where you're living and you'll swab areas that have dust. So like notorious areas like on tops of doors, on tops of curtain rods, on the tops of fans if you're not OCD like me and you dust all the time, um, but just areas that are up high and that you can get a good coating of dust off of. And so you'll go around and you'll swab different areas in your house. And they have the instructions in the kit, so don't worry. Um, you don't have to like memorize everything. Um, and then you pack it up and you send it back and then they get you the results back. Um, and then you'll get a, a reading out of how moldy your home is. Anything above a two is considered moldy. Um, the higher, obviously, above two that it is, the worse that it is. So those were the two ways that I got my home tested for mold. Um, and they're what I'm going to use any other location I ever live in the, in the future. Um, because I do have the genetic propensity, which I'll talk about in another video. I'm, 
I do have the HLA-DR um, sequencing little snip in my DNA, which means it's harder for me to clear mold out of my system. So I have to, you know, basically just be super OCD clean where I live and make sure and take certain precautions, which I'll go into in more detail with more videos. So hope this was helpful. And honestly, like I want to make videos that you guys want to watch. So let me know feedback down below. Let me know what you want to see. Um, and again, I like to keep this page a place of healing. So if you have co like comments that contradict what I'm saying, I don't care if you don't agree with me. Let's just have a dialogue in a kind way. Um, and if you are rude and just outright ridiculous, I will block you um, just a heads up. So let's keep this place like a, a nice healing space and one of open, engaging dialogue. So looking forward to hearing your comments and yeah anyway hope that you are feeling better and if you're not feeling better um, you can feel free to reach out to me i am an integrative medicine practitioner in training so this is what i do for a business as well um, and you we can set up a 15 minute free consultation and then go from there so and i said free consultation so 15 minute free consultation and then we can go from there uh, to see if i can help you at all all right, thank you so much. Bye.